Good evening, everybody. Yes, that was the last time we played Southampton, and we won. I've got the little guy here. He's getting dropped off. It is currently Saturday night. It is about half nine. I'm going to go and fuel up, drop him off, come back, watch match of the day, and then we're heading straight down Southampton through the night. It's going to be a long one. It's an absolute Mickey take with the trains, the pricing. I have to drive there and back in one day, so that's going to be 12 hours and, and video edit and take the game, and get back and go to work the next day. Absolute chaotic, but join me on our adventure. Gotta love a bit of ease. So CD, match ticket there, but it has returned everybody. Because I'm at work on Monday, if we have a look at the back, da -da. there's my hotel everybody. I'll give that a five star. We've got Bruno in the middle He knows exactly what we need <laughs> Bartman in the back, Isaac in attack Newcastle's going to win the Premier League So we've got detoured and look what I'm going past Rotherham's ground Now if you remember on the channel Me, Harry and Sam were sat there, stood there rather Doing videos after the pre-season game when we beat them 2-0 Right everybody We have arrived, finally Finally, after five hours of straight driving, <sighs> now I'm going to go and find somewhere to park and go and sleep for a few hours. See you in the morning, everyone. There we go, and a few hours kept us as the world of good. I've had about six hours, but the weather is absolutely lifting. It is chucking it down. Was it with these storms that follow me away games? But feeling refreshed, change of clothes, freshened up. We're about an hour and a half from kickoff, and I'm literally just around the corner. Oh, yeah! Right, everybody helps when you park this right next to the stadium, but the team news is out. Who is replacing Joe Linton? That's what we've all been looking for today, and it's Jacob Murphy, like flag. He'll go into left wing position, needs performance because Alan St. Maximum is on the bench. So no doubt he's getting close and close at fitness. Maybe he can start against Palace or Chelsea. Who knows? We'll have to wait on that. And there's John Joe Shelby on the bench as well, who's near and near and full match fitness. But apart from that, it's a fully strength squad. Southampton on the other hand. Looking at their lineup, you think of them on paper, and Newcastle really should be beating these. They've just dropped it in the bottom three. But football isn't played on paper. You've got to go out and win. So I think we should get in now. 6 0 Newcastle. 6 uh, 0. Miggy Brace, Wilson Brace, bottom and header, uh, Dan Ben over at kick. 3 0 Newcastle. Botman, Wilson, and Maxi. Wow, confident lads, eh? Well, Carl didn't make it, but his brother did. Hi, right, Chris, you alright? Very well, thank you. Just mid bacon sandwich. Give us a score out of 10 for that. There's no butter on it. There's no sauce on it. A three. A three? Wow. Never come here again, lads. So as the Newcastle players uh, start warming up, actually I was actually there in March, right there. What a small coincidence, because that's where Bruno scored his flicker, remember? And then the players come running over, celebrate with the fans here. Small world.
all on the floor. Had too much. Time the lad has still not woken up. And Southampton have missed a guilt edge chance right on the stroke of half time. A bit of a scrappy game, but Miggy's got the ball. Newcastle are leading 1 0. Can we go on and get three points in the second half?
Southampton have pulled one back with two minutes to go. Three, one. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Kids just walking up. Bruno's just scored an absolute worldie from outside the box to make it. 4 1. Yep, you'll see Johnny uh, in the reaction, the last words. What a winner. Unreal, man. Unreal. 4-1 win away from home at Southampton. They were poor today. We were great. Mint. Enjoy the vlog. Enjoy it. Right, I'm going to go back to the car because I've got to go and edit. Right, everybody. So I've left Johnny. I've got a lot of video editing to do. So I'm going to edit this vlog before setting off. And then I'll be stopping in about South Yorkshire to do the last word. It's a long, long journey home. I'll probably not get home at midnight. As I say, I've got my food down there. And I... What a day, man. Thanks for watching, everybody. Smash that like. And I, a long drive home. See you later, everyone. Bye-bye.